this interview. How are you doing today? I'm doing well, thank you. Thanks for having me. Yeah, my name is Fang Yu Liu. What's your name? My name is Lisa. Yeah, nice to meet you, Lisa. Um, are you ready for the interview now? I am. Yes. Yeah, so I'm going to ask you a couple questions for this interview. Um, so the next question for you is why did you leave your previous job? So I left my previous job due to layoff. There were, uh, at the beginning there, I was hired for a new product and we had a legacy product, there was a legacy product as well. And the new product, things didn't go as well as they had hoped and we lost the new product and then we also lost a portion of the main, main business. Because we knew the layoffs were coming, it was really difficult to work in and keep positive in that area because we knew cuts were coming. So I, I just tried to get everything in order for the next person to take mm -hmm. over. Could you give me an example of an important goal you had to set and tell me about your progress in reaching that goal? Well, one of the goals that I just recently set was mm -hmm. to come back to school, to Algonquin College, to get IMB diploma. Mm -hmm. I looked around to see what other options there were prior to me enrolling into college, and I wanted, I didn't want to get laid off again. So, I looked through and I saw all the jobs that were hiring and what is up and coming. IMB was one of the areas that really attracted me because it had so many different opportunities so many different variety of things to do. And so I decided I was gonna come back to school and I had my family support as well. Cool. Yeah, and the task was difficult sometimes, but all in all, almost done. And I'm really excited about it. Yeah, and I will have a diploma. <laughs> Great job. <laughs> Um, could you give me an example of a time when you were able to communicate successfully with another person even when that individual may not have personally liked you? Mm -hmm. Part of my previous job was training and there was a production floor and they were all union and I was not union. Um, some of the members had issue just simply because I was training them to do their job, except I wasn't able to do their job. Mm -hmm. So some of them didn't necessarily like me. So when I came out, I would have to ask them to sign off on things and I would have to train them on it. And some of them would make it a little bit difficult in the fact that I would have to do uh, multiple revisions on the procedures that I was wanting them to sign off on. I knew they didn't like me, but just try to make it as easy and so as easy as you could. But you did a great job. So what did you do in your last job to contribute toward a teamwork environment? Please be specific. Okay. I'm going to use my Apply Projects for that. So our Apply Projects had a Google website and as we all know Google Sites is on its way out and she needed move to a WordPress site. So we were able to brand her as well. We branded her and we were able to move all of her information to a different website. About 155 pages. Wow, so website. Cool. Yeah. It's a lot of pages. It did. was, but at the same time I was really happy to be part of that project. Yeah, of course. Excellent. Could you describe a situation in which you were able to positively influence the actions of others in a desired direction. I'm going to use an example of when I was with GE. Uh, actually, this one fits really well. So I was part of, we were at three sites. We, we were part of three different sites and our car was the one that I mainly worked out of. Mm -hmm. It was pretty quiet in comparison to the rest of them and so we started a challenge and I pushed it up through our car facility. We all had fitness apps on our phones and we would push each other for fitness challenges and the outcome was always to shed some pounds and to get into shape. So it was always positive and 
there were all these people that were looking to lose a few pounds. And we, we had a lot of fun with it. It yeah. was a lot of fun. And we put our, I put our car on the map in comparison to the other sites as well. Cool. Mm -hmm. So this, all the questions I prepared to ask you, do you have any questions for me? I do. If you could change any of my qualifications to suit or accommodate the position, what would you change? So, so one way expect you have is the experience with uh, teamwork, and all, also if you have the um, leadership ability, this will be perfect to meet our job requirement. Uh, because for this job, we we are looking for someone uh, who can lead for the team and uh, to also uh, have the experience for the UI and UX design in this area. And uh, also this, this will be one who connect the relationship in this group to work with each other well. It will be excellent. Oh. Also, what are the next steps? Uh, for the next step, we still have some more interview for the other interviewees, so probably you can just wait one, two, three business day for waiting for our email. Okay. We will give you the email to let you know how's going on. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you, Elizabeth.